climate change is a big issue and it's especially affecting water systems as well as power systems. Earthquakes, hurricanes, heavy rains, landslides and floods. Natural disasters, often sudden and terrifying, have caused extensive damage to water pipes. In the United States, the damage caused by water leakage due to aging water pipes is also expanding, occurring at a fast pace of one case every two minutes. Two of the most significant earthquakes that have affected uh, water infrastructure in the state of California would be the 1906 San Francisco earthquake and the 1971 San Fernando earthquake in the city of Los Angeles. We have uh, more severe hurricanes, we're getting more severe flooding, and all of these are causing damages to buried systems, like the buried water pipelines. Dur during these discussions, it became very clear that we, we could use a better product when we're installing pipes in Los Angeles and actually throughout the United States. Around 2011, we got the idea that maybe it would be wise to not only test the pipes that we've come across in the United States that might improve the future performance of the system while we're replacing them, but why don't we also try the Kubota's uh, hazard resilient ductile layering pipe. Right after we started installing the first pipe, other cities also became very interested in doing the same types of projects because they will be able to help accommodate uh, damage that may result from erosion during floods, um, uh, landslides that come from hurricanes, uh, the rain and from hurricanes and floods and all kinds of different. There's a lot of different ways that the ground can move during a disaster. And these types of pipes can uh, prevent damage from those types of ground movements. The HRDIP features a unique segmented design that can endure the pressure of large ground movements caused by earthquakes, hurricanes, heavy rains, landslides, and temperature changes. Pipe has experienced many different hazards, and it has experienced hundreds of these types of things around Japan for over 40 years, almost 50 years now, and the joints have never been seen to have failed, nor have they ever leaked. Kubota HRDIPs were provided to the city of Los Angeles and were installed in a number of locations. The West Coast cities of San Francisco, Portland, Seattle, and Vancouver have also incorporated HRDIP into their water systems. The pipes throughout the United States have been there in, in many cities for 100 or more years, and they're all deteriorating. Um, they, they've served their useful life and need to be replaced. We, we could take a plan of replacing pipelines with hazard resilient pipelines uh, over the life cycle of the pipes that are already installed. So when they deteriorate and come to end in life, we could have a plan to replace them with an improved pipeline. Um, that would be the most cost effective way of doing things. Climate change is a big issue. It, it's, it has a significant impact on water and power systems. It's, it's not just droughts that come from climate change that reduce the water supply, but it's climate change creates a whole series of hazards, which should make us all want to innovate and develop the use of hazard resilient pipe systems. Those hazards include melting permafrost, to stronger hurricanes and floods, which cause erosion and landslides in, in the ground. It can severely damage buried pipes. So our water pipes need to be resilient to all natural hazards, not just in Los Angeles or even the West Coast, but all across the United States and even around the world. I found Kubota very good to work with and very, very easy to work with. They're, they're very innovative, they listen, they create good products and services that are easy to use and install so that we can create uh, resilient piping networks that are able to withstand the effects of all types of hazards from earthquakes to all the climate change effects.
we could achieve the development and installation of reliable water infrastructure if we all think about how we can innovate and collaborate with an emphasis on the benefit for all.